Let's talk about motion capture. So in 2023, we got this guy. This is Mokopi. This is a fun, compact motion capture product that you can put on your body and capture your motion. But now Sony is doubling the amount of Mokopi you can use at once by creating the Mokopi Pro. It's not a new mocap suit. The Mokopi Pro is two Mokopi, but also a little bit of its own ecosystem. Twice the sensors, twice the tracking, twice the receivers, twice the software. And there's a lot to get into. Big thanks to Sony for sponsoring this first look at Mokopi Pro. Just FYI, this isn't a review. We're looking at some of the new features and showing off some of the cool stuff that we can do with it. So unboxing the new system is very easy. The kit includes these two Mokopi cases with six transmitters inside. You also get these two new receiver units. I love these. And you also get two cables and an assortment of straps and stickers. Let's talk about these little receiver pucks. These guys are compact and they don't Required to use a router or a phone or anything. You'll be able to just have one for each of your little Mokopi sets and you just plug them into your PC. But it also works together with their software. And this is very interesting. So, okay, the, whole, the way the whole thing works overall is that by doubling the sensors, you can track more body parts. This ups the quality of motion capture. Because the system is two Mokopis, we're going to wear one like a traditional Mokopi setup. We're going to have, you know, our hips, our head, we're going to have our arms and legs, but we're going to wear the other set on some of our poles. We're going to wear them above our elbows. We're going to wear them above our kneecaps. And then we can choose to either track our feet or our hands. All right, so here's the full setup. We have our feet, we have our ankles, we have our knees, we have our hips here on the back, and we have our upper arms and we have our wrists. You have the same exact head sensor in the same place. So after you've done that, you've tracked all your extremities and you're good to go. If you want to track your hands, you can take the feet trackers and you can put them on your hands or you can leave them on the feet. It's totally up to you. It depends on what you're used to using. What I'd recommend is put a set on your feet. And then if you are going to do animations or something like that, like you might be wearing mocap gloves. Most mocap gloves come with some rotation sensors and you can get data from those in conjunction with what you're getting from the Mokopi system. This is all going through the receivers to the new XYN Studio. This is a more animation focused software that Sony is launching. It's targeting studios and people who are trying to create, you know, more professional workflows for VFX or for games or for films. XYN has this algorithmic system, algorithmic. <laughs> The system works in a way where it takes the data relay and then puts all of those things together after the fact in a way that makes the mocap actually look better than the way it looked at the time that it came in. And it's crazy to see the system that just ran on six sensors before go all the way to the level that I'm getting them out of here now. The only thing I would say is like, you should give me some music to dance to. Excellent. <laughs> so props to Sony for continuing to push it forwards with Mokopi and check out their website. Go take a look at it. See if it's interesting to you. Check out Mokopi. Check out Mokopi Pro.